Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Block Breaking SMP. As you can see, there's been a lot of progress on our base since uh, since we last left off. In fact, I don't even think I showed uh, this window was an empty hole, but you know, this is taking a quite a long time. And now we are filling in the roof here and we're doing something very special with it. You see, over, uh, over yonder, uh, me and Hulk went and we made a giant field of ice. So, uh, here's us, and here's the field of ice. And that field of ice takes up an entire map. Wrong one. Uh, that field of ice takes up an entire map, just like this. So what we're doing is we took all these sea lanterns that we bought from Tice here, and then we're getting tons of item frames, and then tons of maps, and we're going to cover the entire sea lane in these maps. Just because I think that'll look a bit better than having some dull uh, ceiling here. Uh, let's put this back just because we don't want to lose it. But there's a lot going on here. Uh, so the base, like the, I guess, what the base is based on, so many bases. So the original uh, part of the base here, uh, with the, I guess, the ring around it with the bamboo and then the wood here, is based on a design by Cortez Arino. And he made this uh, cool thing where he had farms and a ring, and this was sunken into the earth, and you could see the stars and stuff uh, when it's nighttime and all that. And then he had this uh, cool jungle th tree thing in the middle. And I guess the last server we had, we did something like that, but instead of the jungle tree, we made a cherry blossom. It was all very cool. Um, but slowly over time, we've been editing, I guess, this main part of the base more to fit our designs. So if the shape looks familiar, that's where it's from. Uh, but slowly we're, we've been adapting it to something more unique. And I, I like what we got going on here now. So over here, once we s sort all this out and clear it out, we are going to have the actual base portion, which is going to be lots of farms and stuff. Over here is our project later today, which is the smeltery. Oh, the pelletry problem is still a thing. <laughs> uh, this can be the smeltery. It is going to have 100 furnaces. And I hope that's going to be enough. <laughs> A lot of furnaces. And then right over here is going to be a elevator that I'm going to put in here shortly. And we paid our good frenemy time to build us a border. So that's going to go right here. And above that is going to be another building similar to this one. So hopefully in the end... Good, I got more rockets. Hopefully in the end, we're going to have a bunch of little skyscrapers poking out of the mountain. And it's going to look really cool. Uh, some other things that we've been doing since the last episode, because that was the hunted episode, was made, we made an iron farm. Don't think I've showed that before. We made the sugarcane and bamboo farm, which I've got a time lapse of in a bit. And uh, also, the pit of death has been tamed. So I would have showed how we did this, but we actually just paid AAG to do it with our concrete uh, machine. Because he needs a lot of concrete. And I saw all of his stuff fall into the void. It was very funny, I will add. Because uh, my head that he got from killing me went in it with it. But, um, you know, he built us this lovely slime farm in exchange for all the concrete in the world. And this must have taken forever. Oh, no, little slime, don't jump. Don't jump, little slime. I, don't, I hope he didn't jump. No! little slime oh well that's sad oh well um over here we have the collection area of course and it's doing all right considering i haven't afk it yet uh i just emptied it out a while ago the uh, the chest was full and uh yeah we can open a slime shop now which we might do we might not do so many shops open so little time but yeah unfortunately the pit did have to be tamed that's why the pit existed in the first place but it did take out many people while it was with us. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Uh, we've got the base here. So we're going to be doing some work on it today. And I will check back in once we've got some more done.
Alright, I hope you enjoyed those time lapses, but once again, we're here at the shopping district. And man, does this place ever change. All the time. So, oh, the sheep is now that. Uh, Average has a new shop that was designed by Time. And the worm has a goatee and mustache now. And it looks like Moscow is trying to put a shop. Or, look, it's huge. It looks like a distribution facility. Uh, right next to Corporation Cold Sack. I, I keep calling it Cold Sack. Corporation Crescent. Uh, but here we have the shop we just showed how to make. And for the record, that is an M, not an N. It doesn't say Acne. Um, it's not Acne's Anvils, it's Acme. Like the, uh, company from Coyote and the Roadrunner. And, because, well, of course, Anvils, Roadrunner. It's, it's funny. Apparently no one gets it, but... Uh, here we have anvils for 200 diamonds. Personally, I think they're a little cheap. I might have to raise the price later. Uh, but that is because these are very special anvils. These ones in the back, not so much. They're just made from iron from the death pit. So, I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess. But these three here, they all have kills on them. This was the anvil that killed Bangs McGee. This one killed Alex. And this one killed Hulk. So, you know, they're, they're pretty special to me. But, uh, you know, I think we can make a profit on them. Hopefully. Now we're going to wrap up today's video by playing Leaf Sleep with King Domini, Void, and Tyneseer. We don't need that many. See? No balls. You should drop out. <laughs> <laughs> no, Riley. I'm going to win this hey, like hey, I was yesterday. Hey, Nolan. Nolan. How much? This, this, this is for jumping off the edge. <laughs> one there, diamond. I just gotta take off the creator. One diamond. No, no diamonds. I didn't give you anything. So very confident, Riley. Mm-hmm. Throwing that to you when we. I bet a diamond block. I'm gonna win. <laughs> uh, sure. You guys play some bets? Oh yeah, let me let me pull out this potion quick. They're gonna bet a potion to my diamond block. No, no, no let me drink this potion. Potion of what? <laughs> How is that gonna help you? Potion Swiftness. of lightness. Oh, that is no. cheap. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll do. Uh, it's not gonna help. Have a, still go does up anyone have a shulker room. box down there? Riley. Yep. Will you pay me another diamond to go what without any snowballs? What do you mean another diamond? I never paid you in the first Sorry, place. Sorry, I misspoke. A diamond, a diamond. A diamond to go without snowballs at all. Uh, If you win without snowballs, yeah. Diamond block. Okay, sounds good. Diamond Wait block if you win how without snowballs. Does, hold on, how, how fast is this? Well, I don't know how fast it's going to take to reset. I'm not going to throw one. It, it doesn't take seconds. very long. It's a couple seconds. Couple well, sections. Is this multiple layers or one layer? I'm very. I'm just. Confused. I'm just curious to see how quick it takes. Hmm. Okay, that was pretty quick. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we ride a rumble and tumble. Yeah. Not yep. you guys, not me. I'm not gonna fall. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're gonna fall. I'm not gonna fall. Cause everyone's gonna go for you. <laughs> Remember what the non-diamond was for. <laughs> okay. Oh, I see what that was for. <laughs> Is that like certain death below there or? Yes. No, it's just a, yeah. Okay. As long as you don't fall on the edge. If you fall on the edge, you'll survive with like half a heart. Okay. Okay. So you, wait, He's you played me. this before. Yeah. Both of them have. <laughs> yep. Well, I would assume he would have played it. No, I played he, with he Tynes here in Rockling last night. Yeah, but Tynes here, I, I assume he played it, because he made it. It was my first time last night. Okay. Okay. Yep. There we go. We all ready? Mm-hmm. To win? Yep. yep. <laughs> all right. Three, two, one, go. Oh boy. Oh. I'm just not even gonna throw anything for a while. Oh wow, it actually resets pretty quick. Oh, there we go. 
There we go. Now it's just the two I paid off. <laughs> oh my gosh, Riley. Ooh, okay. Oh, that oh, regenerated, shit. right? Yes! Oh, they got little, like, throwing <laughs> things where they can throw out of. Yep. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, no. No! So that didn't go well. <laughs> Dude, what happened to your dog? Bring your dog in here. I don't think that, that would work. That would probably fall for, fall, oh. die from fall damage. Yeah. Well, here's your diamond block. Look that you're never getting... Oh, oh no, dude, it fell! It fell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, so did I. Uh... I'm out of here. Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did Skolanda try the, like, what can we call it, tactic? The n renaming thing on the dog? Does that mean I can name my dog Top Token? You should probably make sure your dog is sitting so it doesn't follow you in there, Riley. No, this dog's built different. Watch this. Give me a second. I gotta rearrange my whole inventory. Oh, are we done now? Okay, then. Hmm? Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna we prove played, like... that my dog is built different. <laughs> my dog is not built different. 